Hey, what's up everybody? This is Dom and today we are checking out the LifeProof Nude case for iPad. This is the brand new waterproof, dirtproof, shockproof, snowproof, anything proof case from LifeProof. And we're going to open it up, see what's in the box, put it on the iPad and then drop it in a bathtub. So the cool thing about this case is that there's actually no screen protector on it. The regular LifeProof case for iPhone, as you can see right here, actually has a screen protector on the front and the iPad version does not. It actually creates a waterproof seal around the glass on the iPad and so you have full access to the actual glass and that's why they call it nude because it leaves your screen nude. So this is compatible with the iPad 2 and 3rd generation iPad just so you know. So let's go ahead and open it up and stop talking about it. Now that we're in the box here, this is what we have. And let's pull this out. All right, so we have a little headphone adapter here, which is actually used if you'd like to plug in headphones to keep that waterproof seal. Um, we have the special headphone adapter. Uh, but right now we're not gonna use that. So with the case here, there are some pretty important directions that we need to follow. We have our little O-ring right here, which is pretty important in this whole process. And here we have a big manual to kind of get you going on how to install it. Alright, so we want to water test this first and that's what this little front cover is for. It actually will simulate the iPad's screen and allow us to test this case before we go putting our iPad in a bathtub. We are going to place this in here just inside of the case like this so we have the opportunity to test out the waterproof abilities. Now what we want to do here is make sure that we install this correctly. And First we want to take this and slide these little hooks right here, these little two hooks, underneath the base of this here. And then we want to just take this and snap it all around the sides. And once you have that all snapped down, you may have a little gap right here. Don't worry about that. That's perfectly fine. That's how it's supposed to look. Just snap that waterproof seal at the bottom here and then we can go ahead and screw in this little headphone plug right here. This plugs up the headphone jack and keeps your iPad safe. So now that we have this all sealed up here, it says to make sure that you submerge this under 12 inches of water for three minutes. We went ahead and tested the LifeProof case without the iPad in it just to make sure that it was waterproof and as you can see I have this uh, little paper towel in here that I stuck in there so that if the paper towel got wet then I would know if there was a leak in the case. Everything seems to be okay. We are ready to stick the iPad in there. So this case is a little hard to get open without any proper tools and, and really the only tools that you need is a little coin here. Uh, one or two coins will work just fine and there's these little holes at the bottom of the case right here that you can insert the coins into just like that and then you just twist it and pop it open. So now that we have the case opened up we can then go ahead and pull it apart. I am happy to report that this paper towel is completely dry. Now it's very very important to note that if you have a screen protector on your iPad as I do you're going to have to remove that. This case won't work or it may not work with a screen protector on your iPad. It's kind of unfortunate, but you know, okay, screen protector or waterproof iPad. I think waterproof iPad wins in this case here. So let's go ahead and take this off. So now we can go ahead and set it within the LifeProof case. Again, with this, you want to make sure that you take these two little hooks right here at the bottom of this and you want to hook them underneath the iPad right here. Check to make sure that your o-rings are in the proper place because if they're not then you won't have a waterproof iPad case and you won't have an iPad after that. <laughs> and you also want to make sure that you take out this little headphone plug right here and we can put that back in after we have put the bezel on the case. Then you want to do the same thing here and just push around the edges until you snap it all the way around the side. 
Now your iPad should be nice and snug inside of the case here. And then you can go ahead and close this little door. So as you can see here, we have the iPad in the life proof case. Everything is working here and let's go ahead and give it a water test. All right, everybody, we are in the kitchen and we are going to see how the LifeProof nude case handles things like flour, tomato soup, ketchup, <laughs> water, and or cookie crumbs. And we have some nice delicious chocolate chip cookies here and we are just going to just kind of sprinkle those all over there and get a little messy here. This is really scary to do, but I have faith in life proof and so should you. Oh no, I just dropped flour all over my iPad. And I just happen to like using ketchup with my cookies. What a mess, right? I mean, this is just, this is just horrible. You got ketchup all over the iPad and cookies and look at the mess there. Oh, the agony. The iPad still works. So let's go ahead and wipe this off and see if it works still. So as you can see, the iPad is still functioning. Let's do something like tomato soup here. Stir it up a little bit, get it nice and gross and, oh darn, oh man. Should I get all this off of here? And ah, oh, what a mess. Let's go ahead and give it a bath, shall we? Let's just take some of this nice purified water we have here and just clean it off a little bit, right? So now that we got the iPad somewhat cleaned off, it's still a little dirty on the back. We had some fun playing with food here and everything works perfectly fine on the iPad. There's no problems with any of the apps. We might have a little flower stuck in here, but that's not a big deal. Let's go ahead and give it a bath. So let's go head off to the bathroom. We have drawn our bath here, our lovely bath for Mr. iPad. All right, so let's go ahead and put the iPad in the bathtub. And so, as you can see there, everything seems to be working pretty normal and we have a chance to wipe it off and clean it, get it all cleaned up and get all the little crevices out, get all that. And we still have an iPad here, and it still works, surprisingly enough, right? So this is the LifeProof iPad case. I highly recommend it. These guys make great products. There is no screen protector on here. Everything works perfectly fine, and it's a great case. The LifeProof iPad case is available for $129.99, and you can get it at lifeproof.com. I'll also drop some links in the description if I find it anywhere cheaper or some recommended places to purchase it at. Check it out, it's the LifeProof Nude Case and it just works.